Please press the subscribe button, tap on the bell icon, and never miss an update from Passionate Geeks. Hey, what's happening, guys? PGs here. Today, I'm going to show you how you can change the background of your Google Dialer or you how you can theme your Google Dialer like a professional. It's been a long time I didn't do any theming video, so I decided to do this one. This will help you to change your dialer background or properly theme your dialer. If you watch the video till the end, you will see how the codes are connected, how to find the codes, how to theme your dialer like a professional themer. So make sure you watch the video till the end. Hope you like this video. So basically, I'm going to show you how to change this dialer to this this dialer easily. How to find the codes? How the codes are connected with each other with the proper examples? So, without wasting any time, let's get started. Guys, here we are. I already decompiled my dialer APK. You can find your dialer APK in the system private app folder. Just grab it from your extractor or decompile it and you will find this folder go to your resource folder and you have to find the layout folder so in the layout you have to find the xml named dial pad fragments so i will show you what you got in so here's my dial pad fragments Just open it with Notepad++ plus plus and on another window you can open the drawable folder like HTPI, double HTPI, whatever you want in which you have all the PNGs. So basically I'm going to show you how to first change this the floating dialer. How to change this where the resource is connected in the layout. So this is the resource, here's the connection, so you will find this dial pad floating action, margins, action bottom. So this is our drawable that is connected with fab green. So you can find the fab green on the drawable folder. So if you change that fab green into any color, it will also change the background of your dialer, floating background. Next you will find the fab IC call. If you change the fab IC call icon, it will change the inner dialer icon. Okay, next move to the color XML. So in color XML, first we need to change the background. This is the background you will see. I I want the dark dialer so I need to add a dark color so I'm going to use the black color this is the hex code of the black next I want my status bar to be tinted with black so I will, I will also have to change this dialer theme color dark and dialer theme color first two color XMLs next we talk about the glow pad glow pad is when we touch upon the numbers how they are reflecting back so this is the colors for the glow pad there are also some color codes of glow pad like background color ring outer ring widgets color and all you will change and you will see the effect upon the touch next you have to open the styles in style first you have to find the style name dial pad space style dial pad space style belongs to there the gap between the two numbers so you can increase the width you can increase the height you can also give it the weight like it will look more uh, detailed in your uh, numbers next we had a letter style letter style is that if you want a custom color for your letter just add here the text color whatever you want so i'm going to use 
the black or I should use the white because my back black is background so I should use the white in the color XML you if you have to find this code also this is this will also change the background of your behind your dialer like when you tap on the numbers when the search result come you want also it should be in black so when you change this it will change also this color so if when you properly do it here's are the final result you will theme perfectly thanks for watching guys stay tuned on the next video i will show you how to change the in call icons thanks for watching guys